In response to user requests, Sustainable Collection Services has added print book, ebook, overlap data to Greenglass. This feature set is designed to help SCS libraries see and understand the extent to which they own both print and electronic editions of the same title. In conjunction with many other Greenglass parameters, this information can inform library decisions about which print books should be retained and which might be good candidates for withdrawal. There are three types of evidence that SCS uses to determine an EP match. The first type of evidence is that the ebook and print book share the same OCLC work ID. The vast majority of matches are made using this method. The second type of evidence is that the ebook and print book item records are associated with the same bib record in the library's ILS. This is far less productive as most libraries now load separate mark records for their ebooks without links to the corresponding print record. A third type of evidence is available when the library has provided a link between the ebook and the print book via MARC 776 indicators, notes, and or identification numbers. In Greenglass, this overlap data has been embedded in various ways. The collection visualization feature has been enhanced with an overlay, showing the number and percentage of related ebooks by all 12 collection distributions including subject, location, publication year, usage, and holdings levels. In Greenglass item lists, the related ebook is presented immediately below its print counterpart, formatted to make it easily distinguishable. The ebook details presented here are drawn directly from the library's ebook record, which was delivered to SCS at the outset of the project. To the extent possible, SCS construes a platform or provider name from the 856 URI. It's no surprise that there are titles for which the library may have multiple ebook editions. For this reason, we have created a new tally of the number, which can be seen here in the item details pane. This tally is also available as a new column in lists exported from Greenglass. To date, most SCS libraries have chosen to analyze their print book ebook overlap only for those ebooks that are owned in perpetuity and not for those that are subscribed. Subscribed ebooks can be included as well, keeping in mind that access to subscribed ebooks may not be assured forever. This choice is made by the library at the outset of the project. In the Greenglass Query Builder, libraries that have included their ebook records in the analysis will have the option to include print records that have a related ebook or those that do not. Depending on the user's intent, one choice might be more appropriate than the other. For example, it might make sense to consider for withdrawal print titles that have zero recorded uses and an electronic edition. As you can see, this ebook overlap option can be used in isolation or in combination with other Greenglass query parameters. As already mentioned, item lists exported from Greenglass will include a new column indicating for each title how many ebook surrogates have been identified. If there are none, this integer will be zero. As always, Excel tools can be used to sort and or filter as needed. All ebook records that are associated with the exported list of print items are delivered in the second tab of the Excel file. For each ebook, we have included several data elements, including the ebook title, ebook provider, ebook publication year, ebook edition, enumeration, and OPAC URL. As you can see, these data elements are displayed side by side with corresponding information from the related print book, as well as the print location code, call number, and various record numbers. This carefully designed export provides SCS libraries with new and valuable opportunities to identify print and ebook duplicates. But it also allows libraries to identify circumstances where specific ebooks have been acquired from multiple providers, where ebook URLs are no longer active, 
and where ebooks might obviate the need to retain a print edition. SCS is delighted to offer these distinctive ebook features and will be interested to hear from library customers about other ways in which ebook data could be used to improve the analysis of your print book collections.